This is the 405, one of the busiest and some would say worst highways in America. From here to over there, it's not actually that far, but it might as well be a giant chasm that I cannot cross. Sometimes when relationships are damaged, it feels like the gap is this big. I'm on this side, the other person is all the way over there. And I need something to help me get from over here to over there. Something like this, a bridge. One way to get from that side all the way over to that side. Jesus is that bridge for us. We were meant to be together with God. God and us in perfect harmony, in perfect relationship. Where we as human beings would follow God's best for us. But along the way, we decided that we didn't want God's best. We wanted to do things our own way. Outside of God's best for us, we began to do things like lie to others, abuse others, give in to our lusts or our rage, give in to our greed, or even hold prejudices deep inside. But it wasn't just personal or individual things at play here. There were societal things, systemic things like racism, exploitation, war, rampant consumerism, waste, damage to the earth, and marginalization of others. All of this created a chasm, a rift, between us and God where we could no longer approach God. But enter Jesus. We are taught in Romans chapter 5, verse 10, that while we were God's enemies, we were reconciled to Him through the death of His Son. In Hebrews chapter 9, verse 15, we read, Therefore He is the mediator of the new covenant, so that those who are called may receive the promise of eternal inheritance. Jesus Christ is our bridge, our mediator, the one who reconciles us back to God in perfect harmony, in perfect relationship, where we might live into God's best for us, not only for our own sake, but for the sake of the world.